The Safari Valley, it's returned to the WRC calendar now scheduled for next season. Eagerly awaited, truly an event unlike any other. Extreme conditions, phenomenal test of endurance. Perhaps strange then that a man renowned for his flamboyant, flat-out approach mastered the treacherous African stages better than most. Colin McRae, three-time Safari winner, first with Subaru in 1997, then twice with Ford, driving the new Focus to a sensational victory in 1999. You, you never ever imagined when you saw the style of Colin, his flamboyant driving style and everything, you never ever imagined that he had the this incredible mechanical sympathy of, to understand what a car could actually take. Um, and of course, that's what he did with the, with the Focus in, um, in 1999. It wasn't fully developed and we still had some, some weak areas, but he had this incredible ability to understand how far you could push the mechanical components on, uh, on the car. And he just did an incredible job on that 99 event. Uh, but of course, you know, we, we had done a lot of homework and we, we realized that you, know, you have to just keep changing all your suspension components, things like that to stand any chance. And that coupled with the ability of Colin, um, we just managed to, you know, win the event, which was an incredible achievement for such a car early on in its career. McRae would go on to win the Safari for a third time in 2002 the last time the event was run. But there's another story relating to Ford's 1999 campaign involving a Norwegian rookie by the name of Solberg. Drafted into the second car at late notice alongside experienced co-driver Fred Gallagher. I'll never forget actually on the shakedown, um, I think Petter did the fastest time, but basically bent all the suspension on the Focus. And of course I knew how strong it was so i mean i must admit um petter will not forget his safari shakedown i'm sure if you ask him the the the, uh, the message that he got from me after doing that and then of course um fred gallagher came to me and he said look he said malcolm this kid's got he's got the speed there's no question you don't need to worry about that but he said you know if he's going to drive like that there's no chance we'll finish the rally but in fairness to Petter, he, um, he did a very good, solid job. Yeah, I'm sure Petter will not forget my words to him after that uh, shakedown in 99. And those words obviously did the trick. Solberg finishing fifth on his Safari debut in 99 to collect his first WRC Championship points. The rest, as they say, is history. Watch WRC Plus on all devices. WRC Plus, all live.